Uh, Barry Whitfield, B A R R Y W H I T F I E L D, um, the CFO of uh, Lions Cricket normally. Um, I'm here representing the Josie Stars. Ablik, just your thoughts on that? Yeah, obviously it's uh, it's 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 great um, to be involved and uh, well, firstly to have been picked uh, as one of the the hosting hosting teams. I think uh, that's probably something that uh, Joburg per se or Josie in this instance has been lacking as a team that you know has that name. Um, so yeah, uh, we we are looking forward to it. Um, yeah, we we hope the Josie Stars do well in the in the competition. It is exciting times in the international market. Yeah, obviously, um, yeah, we, you know, with the, the start of T20 some years ago, uh, we've, we've always been on the, on the back pedal with RPL being uh, such a massive success. And, you know, recently it's uh, your big bash um, and the, the, the ECB will, will launch a Nat, NatWest T20 Blast or um, something similar. So we need to get in, into, into this, uh, this area. Um, I think T20 cricket is what you know people want to watch these days and things like that. So um, it's it's great and it's exciting. Yeah, and also of Georgia Stars. Yeah, obviously, yeah. Um, we we know our, our Protea player, um, and that's uh, Kahisa Robada. Obviously, he's got a massive following uh, here in Joburg. Uh, you know, we you know I'll probably our uh, the thoughts around how we we draft players and things like that is how to to guys fit around and complement KG and as well as bringing the, the fans. Um, you know, we want to make this a success or we want to make it a day out for, for people. Um, you know, get behind your city, I suppose, is the, is the key thing here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Wednesday. Or this coming Wednesday. Yeah. So, yeah, we were picked uh, second, second in the draft. Uh, Durban have got the first pick. Uh, obviously, it, we've got to look at... Um, how, how do we get our international marquee player to, to complement uh, Kahiso? Um, but at the same time, you know, two guys don't win, a, don't win a competition for you. We've got to be, we've got to strategize um, with, for the draft. Uh, we, can't, we can't rely on two guys. Uh, the, you know, the, the beauties about a draft pick like this is that uh, it all depends on who the guys in front of you pick. Uh, and you've got to, you've really got to think on your feet, um, but make it work uh, from that perspective, and and hopefully uh, get a winning combination. That's it. Hmm? I think that's sufficient.